I'm filming in southern New South Wales, in an area close to the Murray River. I always enjoy being here as there's just so much to see. I couldn't help but stop and film this creek as it meandered through the forest. But for this trip, it was a nearby swamp that I was interested in. The Royal Spoonbills come in early each morning to feed. Unfortunately, they always select the far side of the swamp, which makes filming a little bit difficult. It didn't take long for a young sea eagle to appear, and this bird was definitely hunting. In this instance, the spoonbill was just too fast and agile, and the sea eagle pulled out of the chase and headed for the trees. You can certainly wait long periods trying to capture the action shots. However, there are always opportunities to film something in the swamp. I was quite surprised when an Australian bittern appeared, which is a bird I've never seen before. It landed in the reeds and pointed its head to the sky as it used its camouflage to hide itself. The swamp pirate is always an exciting bird to film as it can be extremely difficult to get close to. I didn't move a muscle as this bird flew close to the hide always keeping its head down as it searched for a frog, water rat or a small bird. It was late morning and the light was starting to get harsh. Suddenly the spoonbills took to the air, which meant there was an eagle close by. It was a young eagle again, and this time it got lucky, as a spoonbill flew in the same direction, directly below it. It looked like the spoonbill had made a big mistake, as the eagle went into a dive. I lost them for a second, but soon realised the chase was still on. Once again, the spoonbill had the edge. The eagle appeared again, but as always, it was at the far side of the swamp, around 400 metres from my hide. I recalled thinking how exciting it would be to film the eagles up close, but I wasn't ready for what happened next. Two young birds flew right in front of my hide, and I captured a scene I won't forget any time soon. I would have loved to have filmed an eagle catching spoonbill, but I think the morning was pretty special regardless.